if you're seeing this video. That means I've been murdered. And I think I know who did it. They fight and bite and fight and bite and fight. They fight, 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 and they bite, bite, bite. This is come ride with me today. So I got a lot of flack about not talking that much about the Simpsons on Simpson Week, the kickoff of Simpson Week. So I'm gonna give the people what they want. A couple questions came in, here we go. Favorite Simpsons episode is always a tough question to answer, and I never have a great one, but right now, if you ask me today, I would say the Chili Cook-Off episode where Johnny Cash voices the Space Coyote. It's got a good mix of what Simpsons does best. It's so funny. It's out there where it starts, it doesn't it doesn't end, and then there's a lot of heart and good relationship love in that episode. So right now, chili cook-off. We're missing the chili cook-off. That's kind of like Jerry Seinfeld. We I don't really have a go-to um, I mean I use Simpson lines in my life all the time. I was talking to somebody and they they had said this one's about balloons or something like that and I quickly responded they're all about balloons which is like a really weird Simpson episode and then they didn't get it and it was really not funny except to me I found it hilarious which is usually how it goes for Simpson inside Simpson jokes if you if you're not a big Simpson fan you're not gonna get stuff um, but I also like to use so I says to Mabel I says um, you're gonna have to speak up I'm wearing a towel and so on we We've kind of rediscovered Simpsons over 2020. I shouldn't say rediscover, that was the wrong phrase to use. The kids and I have started watching Simpsons a little bit more because of Disney Plus. And I try to stick to episodes that would make sense for them. And it's a lot of fun. And I find that the oldest one is quoting lines. I actually both the oldest two quote lines back to me which is just a joy and Stacy doesn't like but um, that's the that's how the cookie crumbles Ooh, favorite Simpson favorite Simpson character of the Simpson family I'd have to say Homer just because I can relate to his stupidness <laughs> fish out of water <laughs> way to go fish bulb we just watched mr sparkle by the way a couple nights ago it was awesome you want to sell mr sparkle i am mr sparkle okay mr sparkle <laughs> If there's one episode that you should go watch today, which episode would it be? I'm telling you this, by the way. Uh, I think one that resonated, this would be a good time of year to do it too, is Camp Krusty. Go back, watch Camp Krusty. There's a lot of good in that episode. My kids constantly quote now, which is so funny. And they say... They're, they're like, you know what I say, when you're 18, you're out the door. Which, to have their little voices say it is so funny. When you're 18, you're out the door. We watched uh, an episode from season one. I can't remember where it lands in the season, but it's the one where they go to Dr. Monroe to get uh, cured, get their family problems cured. And if you 
if we can't cure you, we'll double your money. That one's funny. That one has some really good moments in it. So if you're looking for an earlier episode, I'd go back and visit uh, that. Hey, this is a hot tip. Hot tip. <sighs> Graphic. Hot tip. <sighs> if you're looking for an interesting thing with The Simpsons, season two and season three have Homer and his brother Herb. If you you now can watch those back to back and it is like if you watch them back to back it's like a really good like Simpson special just because you know they were seasons apart but now you can watch them back to back like I said and it just they connect better and it the first one kind of leaves you on a sour note so it's nice to have that second one as a palate cleanser palate cleanser Ooh, oh boy. My favorite non-Simpson family member, Simpson character is Sideshow Bob. I love Sideshow Bob. I don't know why, I think he's funny. I, I, maybe it's just because he's like a good evil character compared to where the Simpsons are, uh, to who the Simpsons are. This, I mean, there's Mr. Burns, but I don't know, there's something about you know, when Sideshow Bob's on the on the episode it's just usually a really good episode having said that we have not been watching Sideshow Bob episodes because I don't know I don't know if the kids I think I showed them one Sideshow Bob episode and they kind of soured towards him and and then I was like fine you get no more Sideshow Bob episodes because that's who I am just a little vindictive um Let's see. Oh, Simpsons. What are some other good Simpson jokes that I love to tell? We honestly, I've been bad about watching the new seasons. I just haven't kept up. I feel guilty because I talk about uh, how Simpsons are still good. It's just. I think there's just so much more out there that it's hard to hard to navigate to them. But I think they're definitely worth a watch. We watched a newer episode last night, which was funny. It was where Marge decides to take away or make a rule that nobody can use screens. And then everyone thrives except her. And then they have to end up going to a rehab facility to get rid of their screen addiction. But it's actually a, a marketing scheme. Uh, it's, it was okay. It was pretty good. Honestly, the other thing is I can't really watch it because I'm busy doing things. All right. Good talk. Um, I don't know. It's the dummy, maybe?